that. Let's see how far up the top ten this puts the Brazilian. It will give the, the fans something to cheer about if he can move that Ferrari closer to Alonso, but it, it's not enough in the end. He stays down in ninth position. Alonso has qualified third, but once again, pole position has gone to Sebastian Vettel, his ninth pole of the season, the 45th of his career, and the eighth consecutive for the team, because of course they've been sharing pole positions between himself and Mark Webber in some of the recent events, but it's still eight consecutive pole positions for that team. Uh, uh, just a remarkable performance once again. Not quite as many as he pole positions as he scored in 2011, but still a good effort. Good effort also from Alonso. He qualifies third here. Weber fourth. Hamilton in fifth. Grosjean sixth. Ricardo in seventh. Verne eighth. Massa ninth. And the top ten on the grid will be completed by Hulkenberg. It'll be a Red Bull and a Mercedes on the front row for the start of the Brazilian Grand Prix. Well, you'll have to forgive us for having to go off uh, earlier than we would like to, but obviously we...